Uh, I had quite a few people ask me about the uh, setup that I was using. A few people emailed me to tell me that they didn't think it really worked. Um, well, it does. Uh, let me just show you. Oh, this is actually kind of cool. This is a Hazer. Um, produces really fine smoke particles, so you don't see them in the room until the uh, lasers are on. That's uh, much better than a regular fog machine. Um, so this is the sensor. Here, sits on the floor. Uh, it's about four feet away from the actual emitter, which is here, because it's quite a bright laser that I'm using, and it needs to be about that far away. Um, above my head. These are just bounce mirrors. Um, I mean, really, there is nothing connected to these. These are just mirrors on a block of wood. So, there we go. Some people thought these were actually sensors. They're not. Um, my old heart worked like that. This one uses a reflection. Um, and that's pretty much it, really. Um, that's how it works. That's my beloved Juno 60, which isn't making the sounds. People thought that it was. No, that's not actually wired in, but it could. One day, maybe I will. So that's it. Yeah. Okay, okay, go. Okay, first thing we need to show is that there's nothing above you. It's just hitting the ceiling. There are no sensors. Great. Okay, Phoebe, go, go for it. Okay, Jared. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, Jared. Great. Okay, so Jared, see if you can play single notes. <laughs> Rather than wave your hands around aimlessly, could you play single notes for me? That would be great. Jared, just, just try and break one. Okay, well, Jared's doing some uh, freeform jazz there okay, for us. Okay, Jared, now, actually, uh, Jared, I need you to just, just hit switch B for me, and we'll just, we'll just close it. Great. Hang on, wait, wait for it. <laughs> <laughs>